In 1999, Krishna Bahadur Tapa and his family of 10 were barely surviving on their two-acre farm in Eklifant in the hills of Nepal. They earned $100 a year from selling surplus rice. They had a little trickle of water running to their farm, and when they learned about low-cost drip irrigation, they converted that trickle to a 116-acre plot of off-season cucumbers and cauliflower, which earned them $256 after expenses. They never looked back. I visited the farm again in 2007 and spent a, a relaxing day chatting with Ju Bahadur Tapa, who became the new head of the family after Krishna Bahadur Tapa died of a heart attack in 2005. Now, this family of 10 is earning a remarkable $4,800 a year from a variety of creative enterprises. These include a milk business, selling milk from their four cows and four buffalo, an orange farm, which they bought two-thirds of an acre, uh, a mile above their farm, they grow minnows, which they sell to other farmers uh, with fish ponds. And they grow and sell goats, which they sell for the meat. Now all of the five young children will go to school as long as they want to, in contrast to the two wives of Krishna Bahadur Tapa, who uh, are illiterate. And Du Bahadur Tapa and his family have many dreams for the future and are very happy now that they are prosperous, have all the food they want to eat, and they've moved into a new $2,300 house that they built with their earnings.